Hey everyone, Trey Amick here from Magnet Forensics, and today I'm really excited to talk about Email Explorer being available for both Axiom and Axiom Cyber. So we've already got Axiom Examine open and we have processed our case. As you can see, we have lots of different evidence items in here that include various types of uh, email. We're gonna go ahead and navigate from our case dashboard now though and head on over to the artifact view. Now our artifact view has been fine for being able to you know, review uh, contacts, emails, uh, notes, tasks from Outlook, very quick and easy and being able to, to select it, having that column view on the right-hand side, being able to see that information in the details panel, seeing things such as the body and the headers, the folder information, and if there are you know, attachments uh, included in that. But honestly, it's a little difficult, especially for our non-technical stakeholders that we would provide this information to kind of have that column view of reviewing this data very quickly and efficiently. So we wanted to kind of think of a new way of being able to show this information and an easier way of being able to see, you know, how the email was structured, the email attachments, how people structure their Outlook uh, folders within their uh, system as well too. So we have the email explorer. So I'm gonna go up to tools and click on build email explorer. We're gonna have to run this on every case. So this is one of those uh, pre-processing options that you can uh, select beforehand or you can run it when you want to. And as you can see on the left-hand side now, all of our options for our various email accounts that we've added into this. So we can start working down the left-hand side. This has a very quick and natural feel to Outlook. So a lot of people are gonna be very familiar with this and being able to review evidence much, much faster. And it just gives a better seamless view of working through how that end user would have seen this data. So as we can see here, we can uh, click on an email. We have that great preview right in the center of a screen. On the right hand side, we still have our details panel where we have all the artifact information. We still have information linked to the email attachments, but they're also embedded in the email as one would uh, naturally see it. We also have advanced filtering options at the top as well too. So, you know, being able to include or exclude certain items, Boolean operators or and or not, being able to filter messages by the recipient and the senders. We also can, you know, uh, tag the messages as evidence in the case very quickly from this view. And it's important to note that, you know, tagging both the email and the attachments as evidence at the same time, instead of having to do it individually like before when you were within the artifact view. So keep this in mind, absolutely use the Email Explorer too when you're working mobile investigations. You know, the great part about having that full file system approach is that you include that email uh, capture as well. So you're able to review that information. But you know, anytime you're working with Apple Mail, Outlook, Gmail, if you're doing the direct acquisition from Axiom Cyber, put this information in, run it through our Email Explorer, and you're gonna have a very quick and easy way of being able to navigate through and reviewing that evidence for your case. We'll see you next time. Thanks.